What's going on, my Fly Happy family? It's your boy, Izzy. Welcome if you're new. Shannon Sharp, man, he got on first take and he exploded on Molly and called out all the women who was talking to nonsense, saying Caitlin Clark wasn't good enough, man. We're about to get right into it, but before we do that, y'all make sure y'all hit that thumbs up for your boy if you like the content. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We're trying to hit at least 12.8 before the end of the day, so if y'all can help me out with that, I highly appreciate it. And don't forget to get in the comment section and let me know what y'all think about this. Let's get it. But I must say, Shay Shay, I, I'm disappointed in you. And, and, and Molly, I'm disappointed in you. I'm just, uh, because we're meant this first. What happened? We, 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 the, the, the kind of heat that me and Shannon have had to take. Molly, what's up? You understand? Uh, because here's where I'm at, Molly. Where all the ladies at? Huh? What, did, what did I say? I mean, uh, who's the bad guy, Shay Shay? It me. I mean, we were the bad guy, Shay Shay. Me and you, we were talking about this girl, Caitlin Clark. Oh, let me, let, me throw, let me throw this out. Oh, By the way, a, rookie of the year. Wasn't that anybody discussion. didn't think Ain't she no was going to be successful or not play. It was just that we felt the other players in the W deserve shine as well. Mo Molly. Did y'all just hear the nonsense Molly said, man? Oh, my goodness. Every time, it never fails. You can always bet that Molly is going to move that goalpost. She's going to forget what she said three months ago. She's going to always change her mind and act like she wasn't acting ridiculous on first take when they, when they was having the Caitlin Clark discussion. Molly, all of you were the main ones saying she wasn't good enough. Oh, they, it'll ruin the integrity of the game. Yes, it was you all. Y'all were saying she wasn't good enough. She said the hype behind Caitlin Clark wouldn't be as big if Paige was drafted. She said this. Molly, I said. Really, Molly? Wow. Year. We, really? they jumped on us. They jumped on us, Molly. They jumped on us as a show. They jumped on us as a show when we were talking about it. Caitlin Clark, all the ladies out there, I, 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 I love them. Monica, uh, Andrea, Janae, all of you. All of you. I'm, I'm looking for everybody, okay? I, I ain't going to look for Cheryl Swoop. She got issues right now. I understand that. You understand what I'm saying? With people getting on about Caitlin Clark. We'll talk about that another day. But here's where we go. We're going to stay on Caitlin Clark for a second here, okay? There is no question. The race for rookie of the year is over. After what they did to the sky, after they've won their fourth straight, after they're over 500, they were just 500 the other day for the first time in two years when they were two and two. These, they, they doing their thing. Caitlin Clark is in the conversation for league MVP. I don't know if you already know that, but she in the conversation. League MVP as a rookie. So when I talked about her team USA, and I talked about what she was bringing to the table, and I talked about her marketability, and how she's selling out everywhere she goes and the whole bit. Where everybody at now? I mean, have you seen them, Shay Shay? I mean, I, I can't. I, I haven't seen anybody. Have you seen them? I haven't seen them. Because we damn sure took a lot of heat when we were talking about what this girl going to bring to the table. Now yeah. it's crickets. No What's one up? denied What's up? the fact that she's a star and she couldn't play. It was just that it takes Y'all were denied it, Molly. Don't do that. And there's Don't others. do that, Molly. Shannon, what are you saying? People didn't Don't think do that, that Caitlin Clark was talented? Be what I'm saying, what I'm saying is that a lot of you came up here and because Caitlin Clark was getting shine, you guys were saying, don't give Caitlin Clark shine because there were women that was very far hard that don't get shine. So no, we're not, I'm not going to let you do it, Stephen A. Yeah, Mike, there were a but lot I'm not going to let you do it. people that laid the groundwork you, that deserve shine as well. He, here, they got the, are here's they, what are we're going to do. Shannon, are they playing now? Here's are we playing? Are do. they playing now? We don't have. We know what Cynthia have, Cooper did. We don't we have delay, Monica. Shannon. We Shannon, don't have Andrea. Remember, remember you got to We don't have delay, any Shannon. of the women, Chanae. They'll you come back delay, on. We'll revisit right. this conversation gladly. Look, man, Molly just loves moving the goalposts, man. I love the show. I love first take. But Molly, man, sometimes she just. <laughs> Why can't you admit that you were wrong? Yes. Please get Monica, get Andrea, get Shanae. I want all of them at the same time on the show when you have Shannon Sharp on there. And let's go at it. Because all of you were wrong. And you was showing your face a whole lot during the WNBA first half. I mean, I can find you in post games. I can find you in pre games. Now I can't find you anywhere. What's going on, man? <laughs> man, come on, man. You kept acting like she didn't have that talent right now. 
just asinine comments behind asinine comments. I mean, just ridiculous. Talking about she was going to go overseas and not see any playing time. Now, mind you, when she said that she was one of, if not the best, point guards at that time. As I've shown plenty of times, she was the top guard. And when I say top guard, I mean all around. Not just getting points, not just getting assists, not just getting rebounds, not just playing defense. All around, she was the best guard at the time. And now, all of a sudden, you can't remember discrediting her game. I mean, it's ridiculous, man. It's ridiculous. Look, yes, please bring everybody back on. I'm ready for this next episode. I'm ready for that episode because we're going to be talking about that. <laughs> oh, my goodness, man. What's the main ones? Man, look, yeah, I, I, just, I, I didn't want to make this video that long, man. But shout out to Shannon Sharp for calling Molly out on the BS, man. Stephen A, keep your foot on her neck. Yes, we need all of them back on first take. We're not setting her up for success if we send her overseas. Did you see how the guards was playing overseas? Talking about we not setting her up for success. <laughs> hey, man, look, we're going to go all the way into it when they drop that next episode, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this. I love y'all. Y'all keep it smooth. <laughs>